<laughs> Alright, first off, I'm gonna give all praises to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rakakwadash, the Wadi Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai for allowing me to do another video through the Spirit, the Wadi Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai for giving us his truth as worms, the Almighty Star Apostle Editor, that great millstone, and salutation and blessing to the whole elect. And it's just gonna be a quick video on uh, space exploration. Because Esau is trying to uh, fly into the space and do different things like that to escape the wrath of the Heavenly Father. That's why they have uh, they have underground, uh, what are those things called? Bunkers and they have space bunkers. But he's trying to escape the wrath of the Most High, which is, is, is impossible. But today I want to speak upon about how we're, we, the people, niggas, <laughs> Hey, hey, like Dave Chappelle said, space Jews. <laughs> hey, we're going to explore the galaxies, man, because that's a part of the promises that the Heavenly Father gave unto our forefather, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. So Esau, you are right about ex space exploration being the next human step, basically the next human step of evolution or whatever you, you would say, Esau. But that is reserved for the children of Israel, man. You, you're going to explore space too. But as a slave. As a slave. Because we're eat in the kingdom of heaven, when the kingdom of heaven is established, we, we will explore, explore the galaxies. We will not just be here on the planet Earth, man. We will come back here. Because hey, like the scriptures say three times out of the year, shall, shall we go to Jerusalem. But in the kingdom of heaven, there will be space exploration man so let's get this word space exploration space exploration is a use is is the use of astro astronomic ast astro <laughs> use use us oh, let me still start over space ex exploration is the it's the use of astronom astro astro no my and space technology to explore outer space while the exploration of space is carried out mainly by by astro astro let's see let's see if this fucking word man let me get this word real quick Ast astronomers ha <laughs> It's astronomy, so okay. I'm gonna read this one more time. Space, space explore. Bear with me. Space exploration is the use of astronomy and space technology to explore outer space, while astro, while the while the space while the exploration of of space is carried out mainly by astronomers. With telescopes, its physical exploration, though, is con conducted both by uncrewed robotic space probes and human sp space flights. So Esau is searching heavens. He goes, he puts his drones up there, he puts his cameras up there, he puts men up there sometime, and 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 he's never he's never even touched the moon. That whole I've been to the moon thing like this right here. Speaking of it's fake. It's all bullshit. He he's never been on the moon. If because if he's been to the moon, he he would have gone back to the moon with all the technology we have now. He he's never been there. He's never made it that far. But he has sent out robots and drones to take pictures and different things like that. So that 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 has happened. And these are look at this fucking dope, man. This, these are the things that we're going to search out as men of the Lord, man. Hope the hopeful elect. Listen, this is NASA. 
These are these are pictures they they've taken in space. These are actual pictures. These are space pictures, if you will. This is this is this is a uh, Jupiter, but they put it in a different light. And we're going to we're going to experience these other planets, man. We are going to go to these other planets, man. We will, hundred percent. And I'm going to prove that in the scriptures. These are, and this is. Let's get with the word. Let's get what NASA means real quick. NASA. NASA. National. One more time. So, and this this is who Esau uses to search the heavens, NASA. And they have all these different uh, pictures of these planets. Look at that. Why is it so blue? Probably water there. Who knows? As you can see. <laughs> look, look at all these. These are pictures from space. What the fucking... What was that? Some shit? What is that? Oh, like a diagram or something he wants to do. I'm doing it, this man. We're going to experience this, man. We are going to have the experience to search out all these planets through the through the authority of Yahweh by Shemiel Shai. And I'm going to grab that because the Lord Yahweh Shai said himself, "I go to prepare a place for you." First, let's get where. Let's get this first. This is Isaiah 60. Sixty six and verse one, the Lord thus saith the Lord Yahweh by Shemiel Shai, that the heavens is my throne, and the earth is my footstool. Where is the house that ye build unto me, and where is the place of my rest? Basically the heavenly father this is the heavens is his throne, which are which is space, and the earth is his is his footstool. This is where he walk this is where he walks amongst men and, and not physically but this is where he basically put his mark, in other words. This is where mankind is, man. This is where the Heavenly Father put creatures and people and established life on these on this planet. The stomping grounds, in other words. For all these things have my hand made, and all these things have been, saith the Lord. But but to this man will I look even to him that is that is poor and and of a contrary spirit and trembling at my word. To fear Yahweh by Shemiel Shai. To fear fear him. To know that he has the power. I've been saying this is Saturday through the spirit. The power of of uh galactic galactic uh expansion, man. Huh? Because the scriptures say that the Heavenly Father stretches the curtains of heaven. The Heavenly Father has the power to literally stretch heaven itself. So this is a power that 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 should be should be greatly feared, man, and greatly greatly uh, renowned, man, because he is a he, man. This is this is Yahweh by Shemiah Shai. This is Isaiah forty-two in verse five. Thus said the power the Lord the Lord Yahweh by Shemiah Shai. He that created the heaven and stretches them out, and he that spread his spread spread it forth the earth and that and that which cometh out of it he that give his breath unto the people upon it and spirit to them that walk therein <laughs> hey this is a power to be feared man because this is a power that we serve man the power to stretch heaven man the power to give man breath 
The power to give man, the man the ability to see and hear. This is the power we serve, man. And, and he's going to give us. He's going to give us as long as we endure, Lord willing. Or the elect. He's going to give them dominion over these planets, man. He's going to give them reign over this. Over the universes, man. We, we, we have a great blessing prepared for us, man. As long as we endure unto the end. This is why everyone covers after this blessing. This is why Moab, Ammon, fucking Esau, the elite. This is why they want to be gods, man. Because they want the blessing of the Heavenly Father. But what? Through technology, man. Through that through that left-hand magic. Through their tech. But the Heavenly Father, how about Shemi Al Shai, is just going to give it to his men. He's going to give them the power, man, to, to be able to explore the galaxies. To, to, to take over the world and to... And to, and to do his will perfectly man that power is going to be bestowed unto the men that wait and and, and endure to the return of yahweh bashim Shah. and everyone is envious of that that's why esau hated his brother jacob because of the blessing you gave it up dog that was on you nigga you gave it up now these people who everyone looks at as niggas <laughs> Because hey, that's what people look at us as niggas, spiggers, Uncle Tomahawks, whatever you want to call us. They're going to be the ones to explore the galaxies, man. Why y'all in chains, man? These so-called Latinos and Native Americans and, and so-called Negroes will explore the galaxies, man. While the rest of the, you other nations are in chains, man. This is, this is a, this. Hey, y'all had y'all fun, man. Now it's going to be our fun. And Jake, you know Jake go wild, man. Jake live it up to the fullest. And the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, is going to bless his people to the fullest, man. At, in Psalm 16, it says, at the right hand of the Most High, there are pleasures every more, man. We haven't seen nothing yet, man. That's why we got to keep fighting, keep enduring, and keep going, because we ain't seen shit yet, man. We going to see the worlds, man. Literally, man, we going to see the fucking worlds, man, that the Heavenly Father made. This is only one of them, man. This is only one of them. We going to see the galaxies, baby. We gonna really see that, man. And you gotta believe that. You gotta believe that you gonna travel the fucking galaxies, man. Through the spirit and power of your how about Shimmy Al Shai on some fucking silver surfer type shit, man. Because why? Y'all about Shimmy Al Shai fucking said it, man. That's all we need, man. The Lord said it, so it's gonna goddamn happen, man. Everything else said, <laughs> everything else said happened. He put us in slavery and he gonna bless us also. This is the power we serve, man. The power to stretch the fucking heavens, man. And Esau, you'll never, you'll never touch his might, man. You'll never touch the might of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, by Shemi, This is what our Lord said, man. This is St. John 1, uh, 14 and verse 1. Let not your hearts be troubled. Ye believe in Yahweh, believe also in me. In my Father's house, where is the house of the Heavenly Father? Where is his throne? The heavens. So where is his house? The heavens. In my father's house are many mansions. They're not actual fucking mansions, man. There's not no mansions in West Bloomfield, Garden City, Hollywood. <laughs> California mansions. You know, man. These are speaking about different planets, man. Actual planets. In my father's house are many mansions. This ain't talking about no, no fucking... Uh, no fucking nice mansion. No, nah, man. Even though we, we gonna have fucking castles, man. This word for, uh, for, uh, and I'm sorry, my language, but what, hey, it's, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> uh, what is it? Mo Monet or Monet? <laughs> Sound like money. <laughs> Monet. <laughs> Uh, but it says a staying, abiding, dwelling the the to a place or or one's abode. One's abode. Where's the heavenly father's abode? The heavens. Um of the of the God of the Holy Spirit in in dwelling in dwelling believers. Well, yeah, the most high dwells in the believers, but this is this is the act of a place so the place that that is speaking about or the dwelling place or the abode that is speaking about in the scripture is the heavens man the actual heavens the mansions are the are these other planets that the heavenly father has 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 created because it as 
even as we speak now, the Lord is stretching out the curtains of heaven, man. Like he said, I go to prepare a place for you. In my father's house are many mansions. If were if it were not so, I would have I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And where's that place, man? The universe, man. He's always talking about there's different planets popping up. There's one planet the size of Earth, but but times that they call it the super Earth. Got every it got it. it they say it has greenery, it has water. It's and they call it super Earth. You Google it. Let me see. Let me actually see. Let me see real quick. Super Earth. Yep, super Earth. A a super Earth is a uh, is in. Extra, ex, ex, tr translory. Hold up, hold up. Have it. I'm gonna have it play. I'm have it play. So it's, it's all good. It's all good. It's all these words, man. Let's go. I just I had a whole thing play. Y'all can hear it. Alright, so it says a, a super earth is an extra is an extra solar planet with a mass higher than Earth's but substantially below the the those of the solar system ice ice planets, ice giants. So it's basically bigger than the planet Earth. Look at the look at the size difference. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> look at that. That's that's that. And these are these are planets. Newly discovered super Earth X planet could be could 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 be a water world. So man, <laughs> see, and this was two days ago. That's the spirit. That was two days ago. Damn, damn, this was two days ago. They said it's a water world, just full of water. Newly discovered super Earth may be an ocean planet surrounded in the deepest of the seas. Damn, I gotta send this to the brothers. Damn, so hey, see that that's the spirit, man. That's the spirit. And I didn't even know I didn't even know that's that's just that's just the spirit. Hey, this is it's, it's we're not making these things up, man. This is happening, man. The heavenly father stretches man, I got me that just that got cause that confirms it, man. That is I feel I feel it in my chest and I feel that that fire got basically more pumped, man, because that confirms it, man. That confirms it, man. The, the Lord is doing this thing, man. How about Shemiah Shai is doing this thing, man? Wait, man. That's why the Lord said, let, let not your hearts be troubled. Because we know that we're coming in trouble sometimes, man. We know, man. We know this shit about to be rough. Hey, I ain't never seen no dead body other than, that, than at a funeral home. And the scriptures talk about bodies being from one end of earth to the other, man. And people we know dead bodies, man, at that. Shit gonna be real, real, man. It's going to be surreal, the things that's about to happen on the planet Earth, even for us, man. But we have Yahweh by Shimei Al Shai to strengthen us when they don't, man. These people have nothing. They have no help. That they only help they have is Esau Edom, and he's a man. He's gonna fail them. We have the power of heaven, man. He has the power of galactic fucking expansion, man. We we're we're good, man. We're good as long as we trust and Yahweh by Shimei Al Shai. We're fucking good, man. We're we're. We, man, we got the best of hope, man. We got, man, we got the best of hope. Man, that just, that just fucking, that got me charged now. I got me pumped. Verse three, 
And if I go to prepare a place for you, I will come again because the Lord is going to come and deliver us, man. Lord willing, we be a part of that number and receive you unto myself that that where I am, there ye may be also, man. And where and whether I go, ye, ye know and the in the way ye know. So, hey, we're going to we're going to see our Lord again, man. We're going to see how shy again and he's going to be he's going to be in his glorified state and we're going to be in our glorified state man it's going to be fucking beautiful man hey i remember elder yashawamba uh, not elder yashawamba i believe it's elder dimashifa he had a dream about about us being on a ship in space man and we was, it was basically at a ball man it's like brothers was dressed up and in garments man garments that 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 he did play like one garment it was like dripping gold like not like literally dripping gold like but not falling on the ground, man. Like, the things we're about to do is about to be crazy, man. It's about to be crazy, man. You know Jake go all out, man. You can only imagine how far out the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Bashim Shai is. Imagine our Lord Yahweh Shai, man, in his glory. And look at him when he was Solomon, bro. Look at him when he was Solomon. Now imagine him. Oh, man, it's going to be fucking wild, man. It's gonna be wild, man. It's gonna be fucking wild. I can't wait. That these are those are these are the things that are supposed to lift us as as we get closer and closer, man. This is Psalm 16 and verse 11. The reward, man. The prize. What make you go to work every day, man? That fucking paycheck at the end of the week. It, all right, that wasn't too bad. That shit is all right. The week wasn't too bad. Same thing with this, man. The affliction is not going to be compared to the glory that will be revealed in us, man. All that's going to be like fucking cakewalk when we in the kingdom. We'll be like, damn, I was complaining about that. That little shit. <laughs> but ain't that, man. Man. Psalm 16 and verse 11. That, thus what, thus what I sh uh, <laughs> thou will show, show me the path to life. And thy presence is is fullness of joy. At thy right hand, there are pleasures forevermore. And I'm going to end with that, man. Lord, well, I hope this lesson was edifying. I know I was messing up with my reading. I apologize, but I hope it be edifying to whoever ears are here. Hey, this, see, in videos like this, uplifting, that, that all get under the radar, man. It's because Esau has an agenda. Uh, agenda in his fucking hand he, he may try to make us look bad man we're trying to establish our kingdom man huh? for 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 against yours honestly for the heavenly father how about me outside we're paving the way as john did lord willing we be a part of that number it's paving the way for for our lord to return man huh? so it so we get the fuck up out of this wicked world because this world is fully wicked it's gross gross wickedness if this was a righteous world, there would be no complaints. But this is not a righteous world. This is a wicked world. And it's being war ruled by the wickedest of wicked people. And it must come down, man. And the one to take it down will be the heavenly father, Yahweh Bashem Shai. So with that, all praises be to Yahweh Bashem Shai. Bashem Rekha Kodash. And with that, Shai.